Hello and welcome to the Reiki Gem Wellness Channel. Today we're going to be talking about the top four crystal healing benefits of leopard skin jasper, the stone of the shadow. For those who are new to the channel, my name is Shannon and I'm a certified Reiki master and teacher and a certified gemologist and I combine those skills and passions to provide you with the knowledge, tools, and opportunities to start incorporating crystal healing into your everyday life, just everyday practical life situations. And today we're starting with leopard skin jasper. And the jasper family, it can be a little overlooked when we're thinking about crystal healing and the gemstones that we want to incorporate into our lives. There are so many different varieties of Jasper and they all have unique and beautiful qualities. Uh, but for some reason, people tend to gravitate towards other gemstones and don't really realize the depth of the healing capability of the Jasper family. And this is the case with leopard skin jasper. It is a wonderfully powerful stone, very unique in its benefits. And it is a stone that is spotted. It is a jasper stone that's spotted and hence why it's called leopard skin. And it comes in many different colors and they're all earthy colors. Like there's dark red, pinks, browns, a yellows and beige. So these can be multi colored and it's just a beautiful, gorgeous stone. And after this video, if you're interested in working with leopard skin Jasper a little bit more then I do have tumbled leopard skin Jasper gemstones, which I tumbled myself. And this is one example right here. And I also have bracelet and gemstone sets. All, both of these are available in my online crystal healing store and you should check those out. I'll put the link in the description below. <clears throat> so to start in leopard skin Jasper, the stone of the shadow. So the first benefit of working with leopard skin Jasper is that it's part of the Jasper family and it's incredibly nurturing the entire Jasper family is such a comforting and nurturing stone. Any Jasper that you pick up, red, yellow, ocean, picture, desert, all of these Jaspers will have that base quality to it. So if you're having a day or a year in which you feel like you need some extra soothing and comfort and nurturing, then sitting with any of the Jaspers is going to help you feel, you know, a little safer. And leopard skin Jasper in particular, since it is comprised of all of these earthy, warm colors, really reminds us of, of Mother Earth and Mother Nature. And it's like she's giving you a hug, some comfort. And sitting with Jasper is, it's like sitting with a close friend, somebody who accepts you just as you are with all your qualities and traits, someone that you just feel really open and comfortable with. So if you're looking for that, just a little bit of self care, then sitting with leopard skin Jasper is very helpful. So the second benefit of leopard skin Jasper is that it helps you work with your shadow self. And what does this mean? Well, this means that we should know and acknowledge all aspects of ourselves. And as human beings, we do tend to embrace the light or good aspects of ourselves and shy away from those negative or darker aspects of ourselves. And these are just subjective labels that we put on it. But we have to remember that the light and the dark, they complement each other. And we see the light. We notice the brightness of the light because it 
is shat it has shadow. So that's how we see the light. And we may cherish the loving and compassionate parts of ourselves and and we don't want to look at anger or frustration, but we forget that sometimes anger and frustration like motivates us and drives us to make change in the world. And so both are positive qualities that can help us. We just need to kind of let those labels go and explore and understand those parts of ourselves and why they arise for us. And when you sit with leopard skin, Jasper, while you're intentionally looking at the shadow parts of yourself, it makes it less scary because it helps you detach from the emotion that might be clinging to some of the darker parts of our lives. So it could be experiences we've already had that we are ashamed of or we are scared of that we don't want to look at or parts of our personality and it just helps us detach from the the shame the fear any guilt that may be associated with it so it helps us be a little bit more objective in looking at those parts of ourselves and it it also helps us look at those scary parts. If it's scary, it might not be, but the parts that we're avoiding or denying and reminds us that we can we can maneuver the dark because we are also connected to the light within us. This stone reminds us that we're always connected to the light. We're always going to be supported by the energy of the earth. So we can look at this stuff without being afraid without being scared and then also like when the lotus flower grows up through the mud and becomes a beautiful beautiful flower sometimes in our spiritual development we have to walk down a darker path and address and acknowledge those parts of ourselves that we need to resolve that we need to work with so that we can make spiritual progress. And leopard skin jasper helps us do that. So the third benefit of working with leopard skin jasper is that it is a really powerful shamanic stone. And in particular, it helps you identify your personal animal totems. So if that's something you're really interested in, you've wanted to make contact with either your spirit animal or your animal totem, then sitting and meditating with leopard skin jasper will help you make that connection, will help just the right animal rise up for you and allow you to notice which one it is. And it could happen during meditation or it could happen as you're out and about in your day and you notice that a certain animal keeps on showing up for you. It will enable you to notice it when it happens. So then the fourth benefit of leopard skin jasper is that it helps you dissolve karmic residue. And we've talked about this before with some of the other gemstones. But this also helps us along with our spiritual progression and working with our shadow self, because here we have to take a look at what has come before, what has come before this life. And even if we have resolved some of our karmic issues from previous lives, old past life contracts, fears, doubts, things that have risen from previous life experiences, even if we've resolved all of that and we've worked through it, there is often an energetic residue that's left behind that might still be holding us back. And the analogy that I make is it's like a well-used glass coffee pot or your favorite teacup that you use over and over again. And it often, even though you wash it and you clean it, it leaves this this film on the cup 
or on the coffee pot, this brown haze. And sometimes you really need to get in there with some vinegar and a, and a scrubber and just scrub all that off so that you have a nice clean cup, a nice clean coffee pot. And that is what Leopard Skin Jasper helps you do. It helps you clean away that residue and unblock anything that might still be holding you back on spiritual pre uh, progression. It helps you cut ties with those old issues and they're no longer holding you back. So Leopard Skin Jasper is a really beautiful and unique stone that is really comforting and it wants you to an explore and either accept or work through those parts of yourself that you don't want to look at. And either you acknowledge their wonderful benefit to your life or you work through and you let them go. That's what Leopard Skin Jasper wants to help you do. Thank you so much for joining me today to talk about this really lovely, gorgeous leopard skin jasper stone and how it can help you in your everyday life. And if you are interested in working with leopard skin jasper more, then in two days I'll be posting a guided meditation designed specifically for leopard skin jasper. And you don't have to have the jasper stone with you to benefit from the meditation. If anything in this video or any of my prompts during the guided meditation, either they, they call to you, they feel really familiar, or they heavily trigger you, then that's a sign that you should purchase some leopard skin jasper and work with it some more. So thank you so much for joining me today. If you're new to the channel, remember that I talk about a different gemstone every single week. So if you're interested in crystal healing and discovering the gemstones that benefit you the most, then make sure to hit the subscribe button so you won't miss a single episode. Thank you so much, and I'll see you during the guided meditation.